Greetings to you this day. This is Michelle Strickland, and I'm coming to you today with the weekly social skills lesson. It's social skills number 14, and it's, it's called handling peer pressure. Today, I want to talk to you about something that affects us all at some point in our lives, peer pressure. Peer pressure is the influence exerted by a peer group encouraging individual individuals to change their attitudes, values, and behaviors to conform to those of the group. It's a powerful force that can shape our decisions, sometimes leading us down paths we might not have chosen otherwise. We've got to watch out following behind other people. You know, if they're not good leaders, they've got to watch it. But, you know, I know it's hard where you're at some, some places on the earth. But this, you know... It's, it's, not, it's not easy. We've got to be careful who we follow. But how do we handle peer pressure? How do we stay true to ourselves and to, you know, while navigating the sometimes overwhelming influence of our peers? Firstly, it's important to recognize that peer pressure comes in many forms. It can be subtle, like when your friends make jokes about something you don't agree with, or if you can... Or if you can be more direct, like when they pressure you to try to do something you're not comfortable with. Regardless of its form, the key is to stay grounded in your own values and beliefs. Sometimes you got to stand, when you have the opportunity and you're able to, you need to stand up for how you believe. That's what's wrong now is that enough of us didn't stand up for what was, what was the right thing. I'm not talking about the criminal stuff that, you know, the world is running crazy now because we didn't stand up for what the right thing is. We're all going to fall short, so I'm not talking about the extreme situations where people, you know, where it becomes criminal. I'm not talking about that. One way to do this is by practicing assertiveness. Assertiveness means expressing your thoughts, feelings, and beliefs in a respectful and confident manner. When faced with peer pressure, assertiveness allows you to communicate your boundaries clearly and assert your own autonomy. For example, if your friends are pressuring you to engage in risky behavior, you can firmly but politely decline, explaining that it goes against your values and you'd rather not participate. Just that simple. If they don't like you for that, if it's something that you don't feel comfortable with and you tell your friends that and they, they, they uh, give you a hard time about it, if it's something that's going against your nature... Then, then they're not really your friends. They're not good friends for you. Another important skill in handling peer pressure is building a strong support network. Surrounding yourself with friends who share your values and res respect your boundaries can provide a, you know, a buffer against negative peer influence. These friends can offer encouragement, advice, and perspectives when you're faced with difficult decisions, helping you to stay true to yourself even in the face of, of pressure. You know, that's why I want, I got to make sure that I have my comments open on all of, all of my videos because the people, there's some of y'all, there's hundreds of people that, that respond and watch those videos. Those are people that think similar like to see the same kind of thing so y'all should be networking with each other that's the whole point of me doing all of this stuff is for you all to meet people that you have similar uh thinking with you know hopefully people will start catching on to that but i'm gonna have to go in and check my settings and make sure i have my settings open for people to be able to leave comments so you can be able to interact with each other lastly remember that it's okay to say no Saying no doesn't make you weak or uncool. It shows strength and, you know, self-respect. It does. I agree with that. It's important to prioritize your well-being and make, make, you know, decisions that align with your values, even if it means going against the crowd. My battery's getting ready to go out. In conclusion, peer pressure is a powerful focus, excuse me, is a powerful force that can influence our decisions and behaviors, but it doesn't have to control us. By practicing assertiveness, building a strong support network, and prioritizing our own values and beliefs, you know, we can navigate peer pressure with confidence and integrity. Let's stand firm in who we are and make choices that reflect the best versions of, of ourselves, okay? Thank you.